Hey folks, Matt Rabbit here with a new game. Yes, it's been a while since I come out with a new game. Hardland, available on Steam Early Access. So obviously a lot of things in this particular game are not yet available. Features that will be added soon. Um, as an Early Access game, it's actually a pretty stable game. I've only played it for maybe about 10 minutes since I bought it. And just wanted to make sure uh, everything works. Just to do a little short little video on just sort of how you know what it is just so people in my audience can see it uh, they had a recent update it's like April 15th and I'm sure we'll get more along the way and I'm just gonna kind of scroll through here so yeah it's on Steam it's actually not too much money and it was on I think it was on sale a week or two ago so that probably means it's gonna go on sale again so it's probably worth putting on your your wish list or something you know so we're just going to play it just a little bit. I just want to just try it out. In fact, I don't really know much about the game, how to play it, other than just to walk around a little bit and um, pick up a few quests and kill things and, and all that. Okay, when we're in game finally. Okay, way to Fortuna. Fortuna. Okay, this might be... Yeah, it looks exactly the same as my previous playthrough. I'm not really sure if the worlds are procedurally generated. Maybe if someone could tell me that. I can't remember if they are. I could have swore I heard something along those lines that they were. Now I'm just going to check, check the controls here. On oh, the key binds. Alright, inventory is I. Jump is space. Map is M. Then your WASD. Some of these other ones I don't really know what they are. Quests are J. Pick up E. Restart world F5. Sprint with either shift or the middle mouse button. F2. Talk to things. Alright. Turn to game. Alright, pretty stable game so far. Um, yeah, okay, so just mouse button, the other mouse button for blocking. Middle mouse button, you run around. Most of the environment is destructible. And I think some of these things you can pick up, it says, it says E. Pick up the carrots like these. The food is will restore your health, if I'm remembering right. But um, let's see. Come on. Yeah, some of the stuff moves around too. You gotta be careful. All right, let's see here. Inventory. I think you actually have to put the carrot. What do you have to do? You have to put it in your hand. Yeah. See how it kind of goes there. And carrot was delicious, and you see my health bar went up there in the bottom. So armor, I think you can get things too that'll improve all this stuff. So let's talk to this guy. I think he gives you a quest. Dave the Fisherman. Hi there, I'm Dave the Fisherman. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Dave the Fisherman. I haven't, used, I haven't seen you before. Where are you from? <laughs> all right. Um, I don't know if right now these things have a like a purpose in the game, but I'm imagining in the future some of the quests and the quest lines and stuff will maybe you're answer will actually determine different things. I don't know if I, I don't want to be rude. So let's say it's weird. I don't remember. All right, you were there half an hour ago when I was just I just returned my fishing trip. Something strange is happening indeed. Yeah, okay. Well, let's see here. What is this place? We're on the outskirts of the town, Fortuna. Wild animals move here during the night, so I wouldn't recommend sleeping out there in the open. Mountain Sheep Tavern is the closest tavern. I've heard brigands are staying there, so better watch your back if you go there. Good to know. Hey, you weren't there half an hour ago when I just returned from the... Okay, that was the previous answer. Uh, where are we here? Well, I know where the... I, I played to the and, and got into the town, but I'll ask them anyway. Town, where, town of Fortuna is right next to us. Just follow the north. Oh, yeah, yeah, I knew that. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, wait. So now you have like a new option here. So you, so you're a fisherman. Yeah, by name and nature, I catch the fish, and my good friend Demo blah, 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 sells the fish at, at the Fortuna Market. It's a lot of work, but quite profitable and very satisfying. We never have to throw any food away, as such and such blah 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 is always hungry. Yeah, good. I could help. Do you have use for extra hands? Sure, you can deliver this pot of fish to. Demo Vi. I'll try and say it this time. Now, last time, when I played through this, he asked me to go to the blacksmith in town and check on a fishing rod for him. So, like I said before, 
I, I think a lot of this stuff is like completely random and procedurally generated. Maybe like in the future, he might actually eventually give you that quest. So obviously things are kind of random every time you start up. So, yeah. So I got to drop this off to some guy in town. Let's see, Jay brings up your, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Go to my inventory. Uh, large bottle of poison. The hell did I get that? I don't know how you use that. Maybe you throw it. I don't know. Silver fork, a torch, wooden spoon. You can actually use that as a weapon instead. Let's see here. Damage plus five. Uh, right now, it doesn't look like there's a way to compare your weapons. Maybe there is a... Let's see. Damage 120. Damage plus five. Yeah, so obviously the spoon pretty much sucks. Sorry. But it may, must serve some purpose in the game. Maybe you can... Wait, highly effective versus soup. Alright, well there you go. Highly effective versus soup, that's all that matters. I think he can hold it down too, and I think it might do a slight bit of a power attack. I could be wrong. That didn't get me anywhere. But, um, yeah. Yeah, thanks for telling me it's a ladder. But anyway, I, since everything's destructible, I'm just gonna go around destroying things. Examine. I need a silver key for this carry it. Well, I could just carry it with me. E with E. I don't think you can attack, but you can hold down your attack button. How do you, how do you, oh, no, wait, you have to hold down E. See how the throw meter goes and you let go? Bam! I actually don't want to throw it that far. Oh, you have a stamina meter down there, too, so throwing is not an easy thing. i tell you what. We're just going to put it right here so that when I come back to this guy, I'm going to steal your cheese and food and stuff. Stool? No. I think we'll, we'll let you keep your stool. Aha, I'm stealing your food. Uh, talk to the table? Talk. Yeah, let's talk to the table. Dinner time. How you doing, table? All right, goodbye. Like, apparently, tables tell you to uh, tell you it's dinner time. I don't see a barrel. Salmon. Filled with eggplants. Now they're my eggplants. Not that I really need them, probably, but... I probably should get back up the full health here before I do anything. Oops, I gotta remember, you gotta hold it down and drag it. Yes. Alright, now we're back up the full health. It's in these. Not much. Alright, now. I remember the town was sort of off that way. You see, like, there's a little portal there. The visuals in this game, I, I've heard it described, it's like they're very, like, almost like claymation. And I'm not quite sure where this goes, but this takes you someplace, I think. Enter the portal. I don't. I won't go in there yet. So, all kind of things you can do. I'll go out in the wilderness and fight stuff. I haven't done much of that yet, but I was in town fighting a few things. So, let's actually just go and get this quest done here. This is the town of Fortuna. I suppose we could fight this thing. Or attempt to. Uh, it's a zombie or some sort. Uh... Cool. Uh. I put the shield up in time, I think. Ghoul brains. I don't know what that does, but I'm going to pick it up. Wait, wait, wait. Shoulder armor. There you go. What is that? Forgotten level 2. I don't know what you are, but I took your potato. That's all that matters. You take the potato. Forgotten something. Yeah, some kind of heart. Uh, yeah, so you can just go out here and do all kind of crazy crap. Uh, grave, examine. Well, let's look, take a look. Hard landing, gravestone. Hard land. I don't know, maybe there's a significance in that. Maybe this is a hard game. Doesn't seem that hard so far, though. Well, anyway, let's just get going here. So we killed things. None of it matters. I don't know if things respawn. Maybe they do. Hey, how you doing? Steal what? I could steal from him. Does that mean you can, like, pickpocket them? Because it's giving me a steal option. Well, I'll just talk. I won't steal nothing yet. Ah, uh, cool bit yesterday. Hope to wound here soon. Yeah, well, what are you going to do? Yeah, thanks for telling me. Does that mean you're going to turn into a ghoul? Maybe I should kill you. Nah, I'm going to just go in. Hey, the town of Fortuna. Alright, we got to go find this one guy. Uh, I'm not going to pick up any other quests here, but I think you can talk to pretty much anyone. I don't know about stealing. Villager. These are just, I guess they're just generico villagers. 
Now, it sort of looks sort of the same as when I went in the first time around. I'm not sure. I could have swore it said it was like procedurally generated, but I think it's like a feature that's not yet added, so you're just kind of getting a a world. Like I saw that at the intro screen there when I was kind of uh, choosing new game and stuff. Yeah, I think it was like just basically had one world and that was it. I don't want to leave the town, but let's just go. I think it goes to more of the town. I don't know where the guy is. Whoa. Yeah, there's actual monsters in the town, I guess. Alright, we won't go that way. <laughs> Make a note of it. Don't go there. Ghouls. There are ghouls. Oh, who are you? Brigand. Oh, wait. This is the place where you said don't go into. Yeah, alright. Stop. Only those with a cat of gold can go in. Who? Robin? I don't know the code. Goodbye. Then you cannot, uh, cannot enter. Eh, fine. Be that way, frickin' scum. Get out of here. Alright, let's go find this guy. Uh, began with a D. Don't know where the D is. D. This looks, this these guys look important. Uh, Mayor's Bodyguard. What's up? Oh, there, I'm Errol. And this piece of hunk next to me is Clint. That's a nice bow. Sure is. Got it from a dead imp. Hmm. Clint told me the local blacksmith makes ogre-piercing arrows. Unfortunately, I'm too busy to go shopping for ammo. Could you buy a set of those magical arrows for me? I'll give you one of my exotic potions if you do that. Sounds like... Alright, fine. If I remember. I received 2,000 gold. Crap, maybe I'll just keep the gold and not get you nothing. So this guy's Clint. Yo, man, what's happening, man? Okay, tell, uh, tell me about yourself. Be a mercenary. I got born after having done so long. Blah blah blah. So me and my twin Arrow have decided to become property guards. Yeah. My name is Clint. Mm -hmm. Tell me about the mayor. Tell me about Arrow. Nah, I don't care. All right. Where is the guy I'm supposed to be seeing? Who's this guy? Are you the guy I'm supposed to be seeing about the uh, giving a uh, oh, your merchant? Oh wait a minute. Trade. I. So what do you got here? Beer stein. Nothing good. I don't why I really really know why I would need yeah, that, that spoon, so I guess I'll just get rid of it. <laughs> and the silver fork, what the hell is that for? I don't know. Uh silver oh is it shoulder armor? L. Do I have I have shoulder armor. Standard part of standard armor. Left. Alright, well, I just equipped it. Large bottle of poison. It's worth 300. I'm going to sell it. I don't know. You'd probably throw them. Uh, beer stein. Why did I pick that up? I don't know. There you go. You got beer stein, too. I want money. Thank you! Anonymous merchant. Alright, let's go try and find... I don't know where this one guy is. You want him? Wow, you're freaky looking. Oh, yeah, that's you! Fishy business. Holy crap, dude. You got blood all over your... Yeah. I got a fish delivery from Dave, that fisher guy. I'm talking about, yo. Really? How nice of you. Yeah, that was, that was really nice of me. Um, Take this fish and say hi to Dave. See him. Alright. So he gave me some fish? Or do I have to go back to Dave? I don't know. I'm not really sure I gotta go back to Dave, but I gotta go buy some stuff from the blacksmith. I did run into him last time, so let's go see if I can find him. I think that's him over there. Right here. Now, this guy wants arrows? Hey, before I talk to him, what do you want? Alright, Mayor's Bodyguard Arrow, arrow needs magical arrows. Magical arrows from the blacksmith. In return, he'll give you one of the exotic potions, which I really don't care about, but I'm right, fine. Um. Actually, repair? I didn't... Oh, let's see here. So, how do I know if it's damaged? Drag here for repair. Oh, well, you can see, you see over here? Ah. Well, anyway, it doesn't actually say in the armor, does it? Oh, it does. It's armor 100 slash 100, 28 slash 28. Okay, so... How come I don't see it on this? Weapons maybe don't deteriorate? Mm, I don't know. Maybe they don't. 
Maybe it's just your armor that deteriorates. I don't know. Different games, different mechanics, stuff like that. Um, <laughs> okay, so he wants me to find his hammer. Smithy is the name. If you ever need your weapons, or I'm prepared. You're talking to the right man. I craft weapons as well. My enchanted hammer fell into the well. Town well. I miss that hammer. I hope one day to recover it. Well, I will get you that hammer, sir. All right. I will accept that. Quite enchanted hammer. Wait a minute. Now, first off, we got to get some business. Uh, 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 we got to get you this visit here. I would like to buy some magical arrows. All right. These magical arrows are pretty expensive. Uh, I'm sure you can afford it. Well, I guess I have to. That's why he gave me the 2000 All right. Fine. I know I saw the... Uh, the frickin' uh, well over here, huh? I think it was right there, yeah. I'll tell you what, let's go drop these off the arrow over here. Take a look down that well. It's probably like some sort of a dungeon or something. How you doing? I got your uh, stuff here, buddy. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Here's your mirrors of arrows. Uh, you're the man. There's no goods here, but I can't wait to shoot deep some guys with them bad boys. Yeah, complete. Oh, wait. What the hell are you guys doing? Okay, that's weird. Like, he's just kind of like, okay, I'm going to go over here now for no apparent reason. Then he comes back. What's he doing? No, you're kind of meshed. You missed your, your posters over there. Maybe they, uh, maybe they weren't able to actually guard anything without the actual arrows. I, I don't know. I don't know. It's a work in progress, people. Is this really early access is alpha? Oh, crying out loud. Uh, let's see here. How do I get into here? Climb in. All right. Excellent. How do I get out now? Well, there's a bucket there. That's who meant the way up, right? I don't know. Maybe it's no way up. <laughs> we'll die horribly in the well. There's no way out. All right. Ooh, jumping games? Or can I get over there? There's actually something there. Wow. Uh, this is kind of scary. How am I going to get over there? Whoa! I'm drowning. Uh, help. Uh, how do I... No! I'm water bad. How do I get out? I... I... Uh, right. <laughs> All right, so I guess there's really no way to get over there, huh? Does your stuff take damage for that? Did I lose money for that? I don't know. I didn't really pay attention. I'm not really sure what. There's usually a penalty for death in some of these games. Let's see. Can I get there if I actually try and not suck at jumping? I think I can. Oh, no! Because I think that's his hammer there. Is it not? Uh, Alright, well, I will probably edit out all the deaths I get here, because I think that's the hammer. Chanted hammer! Yes! Examine. I'll, I will examine the bucket. Yeah, well, that's an exciting bucket there. Alright, now how do I get out of here, homie? Large bottle of poison. Now that, remember I sold the other large bottle of poison? That was worth a lot of money, so yeah. Bloody pitchfork. Yeah, what the heck. I don't know if there's a penalty of like an encumbrance penalty or what, but... It's on the ground there. You know, I see bad things here. I'm not really sure how I get out of here. What does that say? Stay away. I'm seeing bad things like this spider and this this thing level seven holy crap piece of watermelon more cool brains tomatoes ah oh, coconuts yeah I didn't take any damage though I think none of my armor seems to be maxed out still I don't know what's going on here with this. It's kind of weird. Can I fight you? I think you can go in the water. It doesn't want to fight me here. Hello? 
Come back here. Apparently he's a pacifist spider. I don't know why he's not fighting me. Oh, what's this thing? Strange vase. There is warm around it. So I must destroy it. Oh, what, what the heck? Which? Thank you. All right. <laughs> if I found you here, we're here. My name is Matt. I say Mathilda Marquart. All right. I am also known as the Witch of Hardland. Find my hat in the swamp if you ever need potions. Great. I have no idea what that means, but maybe she'll just give you potions if you find her hat. Hello, Mrs. Zombie. Swollen champion. I kill anything that moves. Not quite sure what that last stuff does, but hey. Carry examine. Eh, what we got here? Acquire a silver key. I don't have a silver key. Can I just bash it open? Apparently not. It's not taking any damage whatsoever. Alright, now, how do I get the heck out of here? Right, come on. Oh, wait. Climb up E. There. You don't have to say. That was pretty good. I mean, the, the layout of that, I mean, just it's simple. It's an easy game to pick up. At least from what I'm seeing so far. This is not a bad little game. I and mean, you can just keep talking to people and keep, uh, you know, getting more quests, getting more fights. Pretty neat. Um, let's get this guy back his hammer now. Hey, how you doing, yo? Um, talk. The best blacksmith in the region. Smithy is the name. Uh, I mean, like, a name like Smithy? I don't know. I, I, wait a minute, I already got your hammer. Complete. Alright. Okay, so then they freak out when you actually give them something? Alright. I don't think I really need repairs. My armor down here says 2900. It's maxed. So. Alright, let's see here. Tell me about the fisherman. Perfect customer. He buys lots of fishing gear. All right. Uh, tell me about this town. Small town. Everyone here knows each other. I've seen the mayor's daughter yet? She usually hangs out at the lake. She's very pretty. Well, I'm gonna have to go to the lake because I like chicks. So I miss this hammer. Blah blah blah. Okay, I got, I got you that. I missed that hammer, and I hope you see you recover it. Now here's the thing. I already just did that mission. Why is it still saying that? I got you your your hammer. So what's wrong? Man, you look strong. I sure as hell am. I'm one of the strongest men in Harlan contest. Stronger than that Demoivoy guy, the big fat blob of you know, kills fish and crap. I don't think so, but as far as I know, Demoy I'm a he's not human. That's one scary creature though. Damn right. Alright. I guess that's it. You don't actually sell anything though? Wait, repair? Okay, I guess blacksmiths just repair on this. I thought maybe they sold things. I guess that merchant that we saw earlier was the one. I talked about the... There's a lake here. The mayor's daughter's not here, though. Maybe there's another lake. Should I go back to the fisherman? I don't know if I'm supposed to go back to him or not. Old Toby. Hello. Goodbye, Toby. I'm just looking for the lake so I can see this hot chick. The hot chick. Oh, these guys are. Hi, I have a fire wizard. Ooh. My blood is boiling. I can't find my hat. And it doesn't help that I'm colorblind. Okay, that's good. So I guess I can't tell things are red or green or what. Mm. Not really, you know asking for help but if you happen to see my hat I wouldn't mind having it back a wizard hat large all right so I guess if we just accidentally see it can I just kill this guy and take his hat stay out of my way mortal I don't have time to talk to you okay yeah these guys are like they got a really weird kind of like art style it just sort of reminds me of some of those old claymation shows so that's pretty cool Oh, I like this. It's a neat game. I think as as time goes on and they add more features to it, it'll just get better and better. I don't know. Is this a lake or what? This might be where the daughter of the 
No, I don't see a chick here though. We need a claymation chick. So where's the claymation chicks here? Also having a path with a tree right in there. That don't work out too good. Uh, developers gonna fix that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't know if this is the lake. This might be like some freaking ocean or something here. I don't know what this is, but it's pretty massive. Oh, hey! Alright, so you're the hot chick. Alright, well, hair's not very stylish. Need to be more stylish hair for a hot chick, so. Uh, okay, my name is Elena. I'm the mayor's daughter. Uh, okay, well. What are you doing here? I like this place because it's close to nature. One day, I would like to leave this town and see the world. It must be exciting to be an adventurer like you. Well, I, I won't be sarcastic. <laughs> yeah, okay, that's great. Um, tell me about your father. He's the mayor of this small town. The only relative I've got left. He used to travel a lot with my mother. Never really knew my mother very well. Disappeared when I was just a little girl. Ah, so yeah, actually, she is kind of a little girl still. So, uh, I'm already old enough to take care of myself. Just joking. Jeez. Oh, uh, alright, fine. That was... Picking up chicks that are too young for me. It's not good. Could get arrested for that kind of thing. So just better just keep going. Better keep going. All right, folks. I guess that's it. Uh, I'm gonna end it here. Don't really know what else to do. I might come back and do like a full bone let's play of this if it uh, meets with uh, your your approval. So hit that thumbs up button and way out. And, uh, yeah, I will continue the adventures of, uh, this dude. Whatever his freaking name is. I don't know what, the, what his name is, but he's, uh... What's, I don't know, can you name your dude? Ugh, swamp. That's wonderful. And I don't think you can name your guy. Warrior. Jonathan Gore. The hell? I don't want to call him Jonathan Gore. Stupidest name I've ever heard in my life. All right. I probably have someone that's subscribed to me named Jonathan Gore. Never mind. I didn't really mean that. Uh, don't unsubscribe me. <laughs> All right. See you guys soon. Adios, folks. <laughs>